Live from Las Vegas, Nevada, it's theCUBE, covering EMC World 2015. Brought to you by EMC, Brocade, and VCE. Okay, welcome back everyone. We are live in Las Vegas for theCUBE at EMC World 2015. This is our flagship program. We go out to the events and extract the signal noise. I'm John Furrier, my co-host Dave Vellante. Our next guest is Mark Lamana, Senior Storage Engineer with the Cancer Treatment Centers of America. Uh, moved from Chicago, now living in Wisconsin. Who's still, still a, a Bears fan, will never be a Packers We just learned that, welcome to theCUBE. Thank you, thank you very much. Um, I'm a big Packers fan because uh, one of my high school, my son's uh, high school teammates was uh, uh, second round draft, first round draft pick, oh. and had a great rookie season last year. So, uh, you know, that's the only reason why. But you know, wow. Bears. You know. Anyway, I'm, welcome to the. I'm cube. a diehard. <laughs> <laughs> Can't take it away All right, so talk about what, what, why you're here. What are you guys talking about? Uh, what's the big, what's the big uh, data protection spotlight? Share with us. Well, uh, cancer treatment centers. We like to come out here every year and see the new and exciting uh, things happening at EMC World. Um, one of our focuses this year will be uh, data domain. Uh, what's happening with data domain? And uh, we just. Uh, migrated off of uh, 4,500 platform in the 8,600, I believe. Yeah. And um, what we're doing out at cancer treatment centers is we're uh, moving towards our all virtualization platform. So we just put in our VMAX 3 and um, migrating to that. Uh, so that's new and exciting for us. And you have other products from EMC as well. Oh yeah, we have, we have. Which uh, products don't you have? That'd be easier. Well, uh, no. what don't we have? We <laughs> don't have Green Plum, the Atmos, and anything along those uh, lines. Um, but the core products, we have VMAX, we have the VMAX, data we have the VPlex, we have Avamar, we have Data Domain, Recover Point, um, Isilon, we have, we have the, the whole data protection suite, really, when it comes to EMC. And your, what's, your, what's your backup software? Is it Networker, or is it? We have Avamar and Data Domain. Avamar? Oh, sorry, sorry, you said yeah. that. So um, we just put in, uh, like I said, we put data domain in with the Avamar front end. So um, we're running that, and um, that's. When uh, did you put that in? That's just we're still doing the migrations as we speak. So that is uh, happening right now. Is that now. the new product that was just announced, or no? It's no. Uh, okay. No. All right. um, so you guys are creating an active, active kind of data model. Is that what's that right? And, what's, and you guys have a need for high speed data. You have to have it available. Talk about the dynamics around the data and some of the things you guys would do in your data center. Well, what we're doing right now, we're, like I said, we're migrating off of VMAX 2 or VMAX 3, um, so that's our big um, project that's happening. And for our data availability, we're uh, replicating everything off of our primary data center down to the um, DR data center in Chandler. Um, and we're doing, um, for high availability, we replicate through RecoverPoint. Um, off of v, through VPlex, the VPlex splitter. Um, so um, that's really our high availability model. Um, and VMware virtualization? VMware virtualized with VMware. What percent are you virtualized? We're 85 to 90 percent virtualized right now. Okay, um, got it. Okay. So that is a very important feature functionality for us. So what kind of windows are you guys looking to in terms of hours of the restore concept you guys are um, running here? I'm sorry? How, what's your window for your re data restores? Data restores, uh, we're, you know, we're doing image level backups now, so we're, we're down to minutes, really, uh, with restores. Uh, so, R RTO of minutes? RTOs are minutes, RPOs and RTOs down to... RPO? RPO is two hours, um, recover time, yeah. R RPO is two, let me get my facts straight here. So my RTO and RPO is, um, two minutes to two hours, really. Okay, so talk about some of the challenges that you're facing in your business and how those ripple through into your IT infrastructure and then want to specifically understand how you're dealing with those. Uh, some of the challenge we like, we're facing now um, is really just working with the business and getting the business um, to understand the needs, I, or we're trying to understand what the business needs are, I'm sorry. Um, working with, um, yeah understanding what their needs are from their availability and their data uh, structures and I'm sorry yeah uh, because they're saying I mean every business line is gonna say I need the highest availability I need the fastest recovery time I can't lose data blah, blah, and I have no budget <laughs> more or less so figure it out mark they're coming to us <laughs> and saying that's exactly that what, what are you going to do for me how are you going to make my data data available you know, 
almost 100% of the time. Um, and how are you going to do it across, you know, the five hospitals that we have? Um, so we're, we're doing the virtualization out of the primary data center um, with our VPlex and Recover Point. Um, Sh share with the folks out there the Cancer Treatment Centers of America. What is it all about? What's some of the day in the life that you go through and um, um, that might not be familiar with, with what your job's all about? Cancer Treatment Centers, we're a, we primary, uh, primarily specialize in um, cancer, jeez. Uh, we specialize in uh, cancer, cancer treatment. Cancer you guys treatment, doing uh, care for um, stage, severe treatment. Se severe cancer um, patients. Uh, we have five hospitals across the country, and um, it's got great commercials. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Thank you, know, you. We see those commercials on TV. That you know, I mean, they're they're impressive. Uh, right? You're resonating to you know people that are struggling and. Thank you. Um, we do put, our primary focus is the patient, and that is really what um, we do. We, we, we put everything into patient care. It's not really about um, the care itself, but taking care of the patient first. So how do you spend your time? Uh, you get up in the morning, you got all this infrastructure, you got to worry about, how do you spend your day? Mm, my day is uh, <laughs> generally spent uh, keeping the keeping the environment available. Really, I mean, and it's not. I don't mean that in a derogatory way, but um, there's, you know, we're doing less with more nowadays in, in the environment. So, what can I do to um, keep that environment available? Whether it's through upgrades um, or uh, bringing in the new equipment, standing that new equipment up. Um, we have an aggressive refresh cycle, you know, a three-year uh, refresh cycle, so there's always something coming in. By the time we get um, something stood up, we're you know, refreshing this over here, or refreshing the data domain, or the VPlex, or the Avmar. Um, like I said, um, we are very, uh, let's, we're very diligent about keeping that uh, refresh cycle going. So. So you What's the philosophy behind that research, refresh cycle? Is, it, is that a financial? Uh, it's the financial and just to stay on top of the technology. Um, to, to, to maintain that availability, we feel, you know, we're not going to uh, have hardware on, on the floor that's, you know, out of, um, out of date or, you know, whether it's just support cycle or, or whatever. Right. So. All right, well, Mark, we really appreciate you coming on theCUBE. Thanks for sharing uh, your, your um, your knowledge. Um, who's going to win the Stanley Cup this year? Any predictions? Uh, <laughs> yeah, the Blackhawks are going to do it again. <laughs> I'll go with the Blackhawks. You think Hawks. they're going to do it? They, yes, I will. Broke our heart last year as Bruins fans. Great series of all time. And uh, I don't know, I congratulate you for moving to Wisconsin. You can certainly get good beer up there too, up there we in Wisconsin. Get good beer. Uh, thanks yeah. for coming on the queue, really appreciate it. Uh -huh. We'll be right back here live in Las Vegas after this short break. Thanks for watching. We'll be right back.